क्वेश्चन नंबर वन वट इज द मोस्ट कॉमन कॉज ऑफ सेप्टिक शॉक राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए नमोनिया क्वेश्चन नंबर टू वट इज द मोस्ट कॉमन कॉज ऑफ पेप्टिक अल्सर डिजीज द राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी हेलीकोबैक्टर पाइलूरी इन्फेक्शन क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री विच मेडिकेशन इज मोस्ट कॉमनली यूज इन द मैनेजमेंट ऑफ हाइपोथायरेडिज्म द राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए मेथिमिजोल क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर एन पेशेंट विथ सीरोसिस Which laboratory value is most likely to be elevated? The right answer is option C, serum bilirubin. The right answer is question number five. Which of the following is a characteristic symptom of right-sided heart failure? The right answer is option D. जुगलर वेन डिस्टेंशन क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स द प्राइमरी गोल ऑफ ड्रग थ्रॉपी एंड मैनेजिंग आस्थमा द राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी रिड्यूसिंग ईयर वे इंप्लीमेंटेशन क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग बेस्ट डिस्क्राइब्स The expected action of a dopamine infusion in shock. The right answer is option A, increased heart rate. Question number eight: The most common complication after a myocardial infarction is. The right answer is option B, ventricular. Arrhythmia. Question number nine: What is the common finding in a patient with a pulmonary embolism? The right answer is option D: Sudden shortness of breath. Question number ten: Which of the following is the most common cause of end-stage renal disease? The right answer is option A diabetes mellitus. Question number 11 The most important for a nurse to assess in a client receiving anticoagulants. The right answer is option B presence of bleed. Question number 12 The primary characteristic of a seizure In a patient with epilepsy, is the right answer is option A, loss of consciousness. Question number thirteen: In a patient with acute pancreatitis, which of the following should the nurse monitor closely? The right answer is option A blood glucose levels Question number 14 The most serious complication of an untreated thyroid storm is The right answer is option C cardiac arrhythmias Question number 15 Which condition is characterized by the destruction of myelin in the central nervous system? The right answer is option A, multiple sclerosis. Question number sixteen: The most common initial symptom of a stroke is. The right answer is option C, sudden weakness. Question number seventeen: In patient with severe burns, the ferriarity fluid for resuscitation is. The right answer is option C, Ringer's lactate. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर एटीन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग बेस्ट डिस्क्राइब्स द मैनेजमेंट ऑफ अटेंशन निमोटोरिक्स द राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए चेस्ट ट्यूब इंजर्शन क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइनटीन अ पेशेंट हु इज टॉकिंग डिजॉक्सिन इज मोस्ट एट रिस्क फॉर विच कंप्लीकेशन राइट आंसर एज ऑप्शन ए हाइपोकेलीमिया क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी द प्राइमरी गोल फॉर अ पेशेंट विद डायबिटिक किटी एसिडोसिस इज द राइट आंसर एज ऑप्शन डी करेक्ट एसिडोसिस क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी वन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज अ क्लासिक साइन ऑफ हाइपर थायरिज्म The right answer is option B, hyperkalemia. Question number twenty-two. A nurse should monitor for which of the following when a patient is prescribed a corticosteroid. The right answer is option A, hyperglycemia. Question number twenty-three. Which electrolyte imbalance is most commonly associated with chronic kidney disease? The right answer is option B, hyperkalemia. Question number twenty-four. What is the most important nursing intervention for a patient with acute asthma exacerbation? The right answer is option C administer oxygen Question number 25 which of the following is most commonly associated with a bacterial infection of the central nervous system The right answer is option A meningitis Question number 26 What is the first step in the nursing assessment of a patient with a possible stroke? The right answer is option C assess the patient neurologic status. Question number 27 The most common side effect of opioid analgesics is The right answer is option D constipation. Question number 28 which of the following signs and symptom is characteristic of a patient with Addison's disease? The right answer is option B hyperpigmentation of the skin. Question number 29 The primary concern for a nurse caring for a patient with a severe anaphylactic reaction is The right answer is option A respiratory distress Question number 30 Which type of insulin is most appropriate for managing blood glucose levels during meals The right answer is option B rapid acting insulin Question number 31 Which of the following is the most likely cause of a positive tonal sign The right answer is option B carpal tunnel syndrome Question number 32 A nurse is teaching a patient about a low sodium diet Which food choice indicate the patient understand the teaching? The right answer is option B, fresh fruit. Question number thirty-three. The most common cause of hypovolemic shock is. The right answer is option A, hemorrhage. Question number thirty-four. The most important action in preventing ventilator-associated pneumonia. 
correct answer is option B elevating the head of the bed question number 35 a nurse is caring for a patient with chronic obstructive pulmonary disease which intervention should be prioritized The right answer is option A, administering bronchodilators.